dear students a warm welcome to another video class first of all i thank you all students who supported us a lot and once again i requested you to share our videos to your friends and if you have any doubts please mention in the comment box of the video we will resolve it in this video we are going to solve another case study based question from the chapter areas related to circle this question appeared in the 2023 board examination question paper all the case study questions are come under four mark or five mark sections read the questions thoroughly and solve the question come on children let's move on to the question dear students governing council of a local public development authority of dharadun decided to build an ad adventurous playground on the top of the hill which have an adequate space of parking after survey it was decided to build a rectangular playground with semi circular area allotted for the parking at one end of the playground the length and breadth of the rectangular playground are 14 units and 7 units respectively there are two quadrant of radius 2 units on one side of the special seats that shown in the figure that's the parking area is semi circular uh, and a rectangular playground its uh, length and breadth 7 units and 14 units then uh, two quadrant of circles which are in one side based on the above information answer the following questions what is the total perimeter of the parking area what is the total parking and two quadrant what is the ratio of area of playground to the ratio of parking area find the cost of fencing the playground and parking area at the rate of rupees 2 per unit this question appeared in the previous year 2023 board examination question paper so first we want to find the perimeter of the parking area so perimeter of the parking area that is we need to find the parking uh, the area perimeter of the semi circle so this part we did not consider the playing area we only near consider the semi circle so look at the figure so th this is the parking area here it's given that the diameter is 7 units the width of the playground is 7 units so the diameter of the parking area is let it denote by d1 is equal to 7 units now the radius of the parking area that is equal to r1 we will take r1 that is d that is equal to d1 by 2 that is 7 by 2 units here we denote diameter as d1 and radius as r1 because we have another set of radius so for our convenience we put d1 and d2 d1 and r1 as diameter and radius and the other circle we will denote as d2 and r2 for our convenience so the parking perimeter is equal to 1 by 2 into perimeter of the circle plus diameter that is we know that perimeter of the circle is 2 pi r so the parking perimeter is equal to pi r1 plus d1 because we will take the half portion of the circle that's will do uh, perimeter is equal to pi r1 plus d1 substituting the values 22 by 7 into 7 by 2 plus 7 that is 11 plus 7 that's equal to 18 units now the second question 
what is the total area of parking and two quadrant of so we will find the total area of parking area of parking plus uh, the uh, two quadrants that's given for special seats that's also uh, we want to find so look at the figure here the parking area is a semicircle region and two quadrants are given there so we find the area of semicircle and the area of two quadrants separately and add we will get the answer so we know that area of parking area is equal to area of the circle divided by 2 because area of the parking area is semicircle area of the circle is pi r square so area of the parking area is equal to 1 by 2 into pi r1 square we know that r1 is equal to 7 by 2 units so substitute the values the parking area of is equal to 1 by 2 into 22 by 7 into 7 by 2 the whole square that's equal to 1 by 2 into 22 by 7 into 49 by 4 that's equal to 11 into 7 by 4 that's equal to 77 by 4 square units so the quadrant area one quadrant area is equal to 1 by 4 into area of the circle because it's divided by 4 that's equal to 1 by 4 into pi r2 square. Here we will take r2 as the radius of the quadrant. So 2 quadrant area is equal to 2 into 1 by 4 into pi r2 square. Given that r2 is equal to 2 units. So area of the quadrants is equal to 2 into 1 by 4 into 22 by 7 into 4. That's equal to 44 by 7 square units that's total area is equal to 77 by 4 plus 44 by 7 that's equal to 77 into 7 plus 44 into 4 divided by 28 that is equal to 539 plus 176 divided by 28 that's equal to 715 divided by 28 square units if you have time we can s solve it and we will get 25.53 square units as the result. Then, then move on to the next question. What is the ratio of area of playground to the area of parking area? So, we want to find the uh, area of the playground and area of parking area separately and divide it, we will get the ratio. Here we want to find the area of playground and the area of the parking ground separately and then find the ratio. Playground is a rectangular shape and the parking area is a semicircular shape. So playground area is equal to, we know that the rectangular area is a length into breadth that is equal to 14 into 7. That is given length is equal to 14 units, breadth is 7 units. So, in this case, we do not simplify right now because we need to find the ratio. That is, we want to divide the playground area and the parking area. Then, at that time, we will so simplify the solution. Otherwise, it is difficult. We will multiply, we will get a low as a digit, decimal points. Then we can simplify, it is very difficult. So, for our convenience, we do not simplify at this time. Mm. Then, area, parking area. Area of the parking area, we already find out. That is, area of parking 1 by 2 into 22 by 7 into 7 by 2 the whole square. That is 1 by 2 into 22 by 7 into 49 by 4. That is equal to 11 into 7 by 4. We will just stop here. Uh, we will not simplify this. We already find the areas in the second question. We already find the area of the parking area. So the ratio is equal to playground area divided by the parking area. That is equal to. 14 into 7 divided by 11 into 7 by 4. 
that's equal to 4 into 14 into 7 divided by 11 into 7 that's equal to 56 divided by 11 that is area of the area ratio is 56 is to 11 now just move on to the next part find the cost of the fencing of the playground and parking area at the rate rupees 2 per unit here we want we let me know the playground is a rectangular shape and the parking area is in semicircular shape and we will find the perimeter of the both and we will add it then multiply by rupees 2 we will get the cost of the fencing so playground perimeter is equal to 2 into length, length into length plus breadth that is 2 into 14 plus 7 that is equal to 2 into 21 that is equal to 42 units so perimeter of the parking area that is equal to pi r1 because area of the perimeter is 2 pi r divided by 2 that is pi r1 so that is equal to 22 by 7 into 7 by 2 that is equal to 11 units so the total perimeter is equal to 42 plus 11 that is equal to 53 units so fencing cost of 1 unit is rupees 2 so the total cost of fencing is 53 into 2 that is rupees 106 so the total fencing cost is rupees 106 that's all in this video dear children more case study questions follow up stay tuned for the next video please share to your friends thank you once again study well